Hey guys, welcome back to the Wild Dog Project 365, episode 1475. Guys, if you're following along on YouTube, jump on over to thewilddog.com. Check out all of our full-length videos. That's where we house them. Today what we're doing is talking about some important aspects of a healthy, functional foot. And that goes into toe mobility. So we worry a lot about how the foot itself functions how the forefoot mobility is, how the rear foot mobility is, but we need to also pay attention to how the toe mobility is. So the reason why that becomes important is because being able to spread the toes opens up the forefoot, allows balance, and allows proper function of the foot. So here's a little test for yourself. Can you take all your fingers and slide them into your toes, and can you do that um, kind of easily and equally, right? Or do you notice that a couple in between your first big toe and your second toe, it's very easy, but towards your fourth and fifth toe, the pinky toe and ring toe, and that you can't get there, okay? If that's the case, here's what we're gonna do, is you're gonna work your fingers in between your toes, and then what you're gonna do is you're gonna roll in little circles, 10 clockwise circles, 10 counterclockwise circles. Sometimes that's gonna be a little uncomfortable and you just work to your own tolerance, okay? The goal is to be able to get some toe mobility and that's gonna increase your forefoot mobility and increase your overall foot health, okay? So go ahead and test yourself out. Can you slide your fingers in between your toes and is it easy and equal in between each digit, okay? And if it isn't, you wanna get your fingers in between those toes, you wanna to mobilize in each direction 10 times in one direction, 10 times in the opposite direction. Questions, comments, post them below. Otherwise, guys, we're here each and every day optimizing function to optimize performance.